Hi friends, this is Mohammed Shakil here and this is a continuation of uh, the uh, tutorial which is based on uh, creation of bed sheet and uh, I hope uh, you watch the first part of it so that you can continue with this. So we are we have created the basic uh, bed sheet and uh, now you need to create the folds so you need to change the uh, edge material to something like elastic. So let me zoom out so once you're done with the simulation make sure you pause it and uh, once you're done select the selection tool and select the whole thing and here on the elastic and give the elastic ratio as say uh, 45 and uh, once you're done with that so make sure that uh, all the edges are uh, satisfactorily uh, it's not like on one side you have a longer length and one side you have the short length so the first time you do it maybe uh, there's a chance that maybe sometimes uh, it's not proper so uh, it's not a problem you can uh, uh, you know uh, the second or the third time it'll be proper or else uh, you can change it over here the uh, you can change the dimension over here and make it proper there so that's all and uh, now you're going to create the elastic material for your uh, uh, corners or the edges of the bed sheet. So the elastic elastic function is given for the uh, corners, I mean the edges and now you can click on the play button and wait for the simulation. So what happens over here is the uh, the edges of the bed sheet, the material is being changed to elastic or I've given elastic co component into it and uh, it's acting as elastic. So what happens is uh, as a regular bed sheet what happens is the uh, the corners or the edges moves backwards. So you have the uh, feel of the real bed sheet material over there. So let me just pause it there and show you the different corners and you can see that uh, looks really good there so once you bring it to 3ds max and once you apply material for it it will look uh, really good so now once you're done with that go to file and uh, give export to obj so go to the desktop and go to our folder 3ds max bed sheet and uh, export uh, name it as uh, say bedsheet and marvelous designer so save it there and you can uh, disable this and just select the cloth and over here you can select the inches and click OK and once you're done come to our 3ds max and here import and uh, click on import and go to the desktop to this max bed sheet and uh, go to the desktop this max bed sheet and you have the bed sheet in marvelous designer and uh, just click uh, if it, this is not enabled in your system enable this and make it into inches so everything is the same and click on import and you have the bed sheet being imported and the place just about our mattress so this is uh, this tutorial covers how you can create the bed sheet in 3ds max so once you're done with that you can apply the material for this and you can uh, do the rendering and see how it looks like so i hope uh, this tutorial has uh, helped you and i hope uh, you like this tutorial so uh, subscribe me like my videos comment on my channel to see more and more tutorials from my side so thank you so much for watching stay tuned